Hello everybody, I'm Dan here from the Hero Game Channel and welcome back to my Mexico playthrough. Where today I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna War Plan Red, okay. Um we could probably invade like Guatemala and everything. I don't think they'd the US would intervene in those. But um, they've still only got 10 military factories. So we just need to start pumping up some divisions. And we should be good. Who the hell just... Oh. Okay, Australia severs ties with the UK. We knew that was happening anyways. We knew that was happening. Um, but they're actually free now. Um, you have decided not to do anything just yet. Uh, and the Netherlands is now in the Allies. So, wow, they're just forming a new government now. Seriously? Wow. Um, they've been dilly-dallying. Yeah, we don't really need to do any of these decisions, actually. We're good. We just need to start pumping out these divisions here. And we'll start off with a group of 10, because that'll get us up to 24. We'll get them up to the front. Because America... They haven't put the political visor in. They haven't got bloody Errol. Which is just so stupid because, well... UK and French Communist... What the hell? Austria-Hungary? What the hell? They're not going to go Communist anytime soon. Which is disappointing because they would have had Civil War. Which would have made our time much, much easier. Go ahead and let's start exercising. We are going to make the Hispanic Alliance. Which is going to give Synarchist influence to all of Central and South America, I think. Which is going to give them plus 0 0.1 daily fascism support for 720 days. Um, obviously, we'll go ahead and invite Brazil. Uh, and we'll go ahead and do that. And then we'll probably start going down here. Actually, we might... Yeah, we'll do it invite... Any island country, currently. Um, right. Um, we'll invite Brazil next. Go for a coastal defence plan. Then we'll march southwards. And then we'll unify Central America. And then we'll probably seize the Panama Canal. And then we'll go ahead and get that. Because we need to get that. Oh, damn. 300 political power to core all of the, um, the old territories. Peru! Welcome, Peru. I was wondering if someone was going to join um, straight away, because there is obviously fascist nations in the ring. Let's go ahead and do that, because it's only going to take 35 days. Worrying thing, apparently Peru uh, <laughs> can almost take leadership. Oh, Venezuela as well, and El Salvador, and Dominican Republic. So that's that's a nice wee four nations we got there. So now we won't be taking out El Salvador, but um, that's going to give us a nice wee... See, we don't actually really have to invade anyone, when you think about it. We don't really have to invade anyone. We can just boost them up. Oh, the Republic of Surinames here. I think I said that right. Bulgaria has submitted to Romania. Oh, my days. Romania went for Balkan dominance. They haven't really done, done any of it, but good on you, AI. Don't know why I'm researching that. There's no point. We might as well do up the infantry. Um, why? You can ask for a non aggression. Are they going fascist? You know, they got a line Romania from uh, Germany. Oh, the Sudeten line got given away. That looks hideous. But at least they're still for the uh, time being, which I guess is a good thing for Austria Hungary. So stupid seeing the US have a war goal on them, considering they're not going to be able to do anything. So I guess we're just going to have to chill and see what's going on. We could invade... Uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and boost party popularity as well as doing this focus in Brazil. Right. That's coastal defence plan is only going to take 30 days as well. We're going to unlock a decision, which is going to be execute coastal defence plan. Italy declared one SFR Yugoslavia. I'm sure they joined the common term. Land forts and coastal forts. I love it. Yeah, we'll go ahead and... Stick some troops on um, 39 divisions. 
They're not doing so good. I don't think they can go ahead and actually do anything. They can go ahead and remove slow economic growth. So they can recover from the Great Depression, they just won't be able to do... No, they still got five... I don't know what they're doing. Ten military factories, what the fuck are they constructing? Netherlands died again. Um, ah, the Yugoslavians did join... Um, did join the common turn. Uh, yeah! Communist France, who's going to die already, and the Germans literally went through the Maginot. And Winston's going to be left by himself. Oh, do you know what's going to happen, though? I can already tell. I'm going to declare war in the U US, and um, they're going to join the bloody uh, allies. You just know that's going to happen. We can bloody and forget everybody. Look at that. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Right, can we get them out? We can I'm going to get another two lots of 12 out. Right, let's go ahead and march southwards. What we'll do is we'll take 12 of these guys away. I don't think the Americans will intervene. I don't think they will. Well, I'm hoping they're not going to intervene. Do you know what? Let's not actually use you, your field marshal. Let's get a new guy. And again, they might still join the Allies. It'll be interesting to see. Oh, we have Vichy France. So Philippe is here. Patan, what are you doing? French communes capitulated. Iran has capitulated. What the f... Just why? The Iraqi Republic. What the... Just why? The communists change on the common turn. Yes, it did. This, this game. Oh my days. The United States declared one. What the f... Well, on the plus side, at least they're going to be at war with the Allies. What on earth are you doing? Holy balls of fire. Jesus. Oh, stuff this. I should just invade America now. Abs just... Actually, well, saying that. Let's deal with the southward lot first. I'm going to... I'm going to need to justify on them. Oh, 30 days. Stuff it. We're going for them. Because we'll be invading Canada in a minute, I think. Yeah, they're at war with Canada, so they're going to be pushing up that way as well. Let's try and take our bloody land back. Let's bloody go. Who cares? The, the US is just declaring war on everyone. Why? You have 10 military factories. Yeah, they're pushing into Canada, but oh, your back door is going to be open, boy. I'm going to come slipping on in. It's probably not the best way to describe it, slipping on in, but we're going to be doing that. And then I'll go ahead and take out my uh, southern nations. Hopefully without the Allies' intervention. But if they do decide to join, then, well, stuff them. Syndicus Pact. I thought it was going to be... I didn't realise that's what it was getting called. Oh my, jeez. You can have that, I guess. Yep, come on, allies, get up here. Everybody's just joining factions. How long have I got these war goals for? Um, I have them indefinitely. Brilliant. <laughs> That's my favourite kind of war goal. Oh, you are so screwed, mate. Where are your divisions? You only have 44. And they're definitely engaging Canada. And I'll pr hopefully... Oh, if I didn't have a faction, I might be able to join the Allies, which would have been funny. Um, until they kicked me out. Oh, do I miss the days of not being able to get kicked out of factions. Salvador Basco, anger by American postur uh, postering. Po postering? I don't know. Um, boom. Do you know what? This is kind of what I was wanting. It's not the Civil War, but it should be an easy war. No, you can bugger off with UK. Oh yeah, we're gun short. Bin that. I'll accept all of your guns. We have 4k anyways. <laughs> let's go. Let's, let's bloody go. Um, 
Hopefully this will get bypassed. Um, and then we can just go ahead and grab that and just core all the land. We'll need to save up our political power, so we might as well just do that now. Um, Peru and my allies also want to join, but I don't think I'm going to need you. Do you know what? Let's stuff it. Stuff it. Call all. Call all. Come on in, boys. Need your help. Obviously, my convoy is going to get sunk, but that's fine. Why have we just completely abandoned over there? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, mate? Let's go aggressive. Let's go aggressive. Just want my allies only sending bloody trips through the. Ah, maybe shouldn't have called them, and they're going to lose some divisions from that. Because obviously, I don't have a fleet. Don't have a fleet. Oh no, America! What are you going to do? You've got you got a two front war. You may be beating Canada, but you ain't stopping me anytime soon with these very very minimal amount of divisions you've sent over here. Just wish I could get myself some more divisions or had some more divisions. Oh, the Washington's away over here though. That's my only problem. Okay, Canada died, um, so we're probably gonna see it, all of the American troops appear. Um, saying that, they do have the UK's land over there to go deal with. Forty-one divisions max. Okay, I can deal with this surely. We're short of artillery, though. We have to stop advancing and just wait a little bit. They're leaving some gaps in the line, right? Organize yourselves, boys. We're gonna have to dig in deep. Forty-seven max. Okay, I can deal with forty-seven. It's almost double of what we got, but if we just get some encirclements, you know, happy bloody days. Which one has presented itself right there? Hopefully. Let's go ahead and delete this because that's going to cause us some problems. Um, let's go. Let's get some more factories going. It would appear we've got some more factories in the U.S. now, though, definitely. Um, I was trying to hopefully get them encircled, but oh well. Uh, San Fran's fallen. Let's go ahead and get the Sacramento. The US have came. They're not exactly doing anything. I'm going to try and encircle those two. I'll go ahead and grab... Oh, deploy eight divisions of ten. Yes. I think we want that. Screw the recruitment population. Just give me the divisions now. Once we all for, have all of our land back anyways, we're going to be golden. I think I'm going to get those three divisions. 17 hours. We got them. We actually got them. Kill them! Kill them. Kill them, kill them, kill them. Get a pushing, boys. Just wait for those divisions to come out and we should be good. We should be good. Right, more artillery. Since that's what we're short of. Um. Oh, another encirclement. I'll take one division. Why not? Thank you. Some toad artillery coming in. They've got 46, 12 factories. I want your counterattack on you. I don't know why you're pushing forward. I must have told them to. Seems like they're not really caring about this coast over here. I've still got some resistance up there as well. How much longer? How much longer? Keep them coming. Probably a good thing I called Peru in. Venezuela's not got any divisions over here, but... Yeah, come on, send your 20 divisions away. And again, they're pretty likely to die. Are we still covering this front well? Uh, I guess. Um, I think the 8 divisions that we're going to get is going to really help things out. In a defensive war. Ah. Oh. 
So if we do bottle it, I guess we have got that national uh, well that decision to get we defensive bonus on core territory and attack. I thought there was maybe going to be encirclement opportunity there, but it's not going to. Disappointingly. 50 divisions max, apparently. Come on, we're halfway there. United's joined the Allies. The world is just... See, everybody I invade now, they're going to join a bloody faction. You just can that. There's, like, no way around it now. Don't know what this division's doing, because it's going to die now. It's gonna die. It's gonna die. You can do an, a counter attack on them. Yeah, it died. Well bloody done. Good on you, sir. No, I was wishing Canada maybe held on a little bit longer. Come on, 20 days. That's not an instrument either, but saying that, we might be able to make it one. And yeah, I think he was actually moving in here anyways, but... Ah, da, 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 da. You ain't escaping, pal. The only way you're getting out of this is in a body bag. Yep, you're dead. Bye-bye, thank you. Oh, sugary balls. Engage the cavalry, it's probably the much weaker of the two choices that we have. Did he actually survive right now? How dare he survive? More factories. I'm pumping out factories now. There must be so many civvies in here. Well, saying that, bloody California is an absolute gem right now for us. Oh. Might be able to grab another wee division. No, he's gonna die. He's actually gonna die. Bollocks. Unless, unless. Peru, 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 Peru. Come on. Ah, he's gonna die. Buggers. It's alright. Got reinforcements. Yeah, that's not what we Go away. We do not want you. Where do we actually want to put these? Who the hell are you? You've got no, you've got no picture. Oh, we'll, we'll, we'll use you. Probably try and push this way. Actually, that's. Right, we do have a general in charge. Just remember that. Um. Probably go ahead and grab. The oil field expansion, probably. So we'll start working down here. Uh, we've still got we've got plenty of guns. Probably from all the land leases we've had, though. Um, construction three. Let's just keep pumping out the factories. I feel safer if you two were not in there. It seems they've fallen back there. Peru, have you just bet them? Seems to be a lot more coming down the south now. What are we looking at? Just go ahead and cut them off. I'm just gotta be careful, we don't want them getting any more divisions. Alright, we can definitely go ahead and just pull that back, just so we don't got divisions dilly dallying. And let's go ahead and take Houston. Because then this division will be stuffed. Britain, you're no getting you're no getting access because I am gonna be the one that's taking on America. There we go. You just keep going though while these reds sort themselves out. Keep thinking we've not got a bloody general in charge on them like. 
Oh, the land leagues are getting cancelled. That's fine though, we're, we're in the positive. Of guns, anyways. Can we get rid of you, that wee little. Okay, I don't know how this has happened, but it has. Need to resolve that issue. Let me just grab that. The Indian People's Republic is. Why did the communists join the al the Axis? I was gonna say the Allies. Why did they join the Axis? Why have you done this? That 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 that. No, you're not getting two divisions. Thank you. Interventionist policies. Ooh. And again, why would you need that? You're at war with half the world at this point. Why the heck? They just don't care about the, the north here. No, we really need to try and get some more encirclements going here. They do still outnumber us. A decent bit as well. Um, oh my god. Okay. Yeah, they're like nowhere near capitulating right now. Germany's invading the Benelux now. So, yep. In New Orleans, why not? Try and push into them now. And our research will not be able to. Let's go ahead and just use our army experience. I'm just staring at some empty bits here, guys. Let's go into there. I put factory up, well, didn't it? Yep, right. Infrastructure. We've still got 54 and only 12 factories, so they're, I don't know what they're doing. Why don't you get the New Orleans come back in? Why are they leaving some random gaps? It just seems a bit weird. Like, surely they have enough divisions to like, cover the whole front at this point. See if we can encircle that at one division. Nice. Getting some more factories as well. Didn't mean to bloody do that though. There we go. That's that's what I wanted to do. Um who needs oil? <laughs> Who needs oil now? We have we have tons of oil. Ah, we got that one division in the circlement. Lovely. They're not getting any stronger, are they? No, still got 54. I'm just really scared that they're going to just pump out like 50 divisions out in the area. And it's like, oh, well, we're dead. It was a good run, boys. It was a good run. Let's try and slip in there and kill this one. Kind of even out the front again as well. Because, well, okay, they've just decided to kill themselves. Well, that's nice. Thank you for choosing that option. Biloxi and uh, Mobile as well. Grab those. We're on our way to Washington, I guess. Slowly but surely. That one division looks like it's going to manage to not die yet and it's managed to push back out. You cheeky guns. Sons of guns. Okay, we've got this other division to come and actually help this time. How on earth did this happen? How dare you? That didn't work out for you, did it? Do we go ahead and get that encirclement again? We did. This division is going to finish him off. You can just go to, I guess, Seattle. Alright, let's get another research slot because who doesn't love research slots? Jump 
just going to bin that, since I'm not really using it. Oh, an encircled division. How nice. Just continue to push along the coast. Yeah, that division's stuffed. Royally stuffed. Okay, let's just let's just do a nice wee walk up there. To Seattle. There we go. Oh Peru, you donkey, what you doing? I'll try and save that division. Yes, the United States have now declared war on the, the India. What are you actually doing? Are they just wanting to invade everyone at this point? Just sort yourselves out again, because it's, it's, it's a little bit hard due to the fact that they have more divisions. Um, wish we had more equipment. We are getting more factories, which is good. Probably just chill from fighting and see if they're going to do anything. We just need to get some rid of these some of these wee little like inlets they've got. Like here, this is a little bit stupid here. And here as well. What the hell's the attrition problem down here? Supply? You're taking the mech. Peru needs a camera with their little advancements forward though. Just ever so slightly. Have they just done a stup- why have they pushed forward? You to engage him. Why would they do that? Wait, is this connected or not? I don't think that's connected. Peru, go, go upwards. Go north. No, that's not- that's an encirclement. So also hopefully be an encirclement. They're starting to see some supply shortages, which is quite nice. Um, which is not something I'd ever think I'd see as the uh, the US. Well, not as the US, but you know what I mean. Seeing the US have supply issues, that just seems a bit odd. At this point, it's 1940. You'd expect them to have about 20 odd. Well, not 20 odd, about 100 odd factories. Peru is really doing bits over here. Thank you so much. How's uh, how's Brazil doing fascism support wise? It's getting there. Does anybody want to join me yet? No, nobody does. Nobody does. But the ABC Republic's free now. Um, good for them. Good for them. I'm glad they got the freedom. Albuquerque's gonna get encircled. Pakistan's joined the Soviets. This bloody game. This bloody game. And they've managed to get that encirclement free just for them to lose it again. You absolute imbeciles. They are dead here. I swear, if anybody else gets any land from America, it's going to be bull. I've done 75% of the work. Who the hell's done the rest? Oh, Peru. I'll be Peru. Yeah, Peru's done the rest. Good. Good. Good, good, good. Well, oh, boys, we don't have a bloody plan drawn out. Why the hell are you leaving these stupid gaps? Have we got that encirclement free again? We have another division. Oh, they're, on their, they're running away. You little pussies. Oh, please tell me we forced them backwards. Oh, I don't think we did. But we've still got in our division, so happy days. Happy days. And now we've got in our research slot, so we can probably go ahead and upgrade our uh, stuff. I'm not going to change the production of our infantry equipment. Oh, my days. What the hell? Reds? I what are the Reds doing? 
Great, now you gotta bust yourselves out of there. I told them to move back the line. Look, don't even think about going in the bloody ocean. I think the Americans have kind of just given up over here. Right, it seems a little bit dead. Trotsky has survived. He's not going to be coming and joining us, though. Going to get some more oil. I just realised we should probably go ahead. That red has now become part of this army. Get over here and bloody liberate. Join back up. Join the fronts back up. Still got 47 divisions. Hmm. Well, did have 47 divisions. He's losing another two. No, really, it's not really been too of a costly of war for either side, really. Oh, we're leaving gaps. See, we didn't, we didn't have enough divisions just to hold the whole front, which is kind of... But if they want to go ahead and give me some divisions for free, I'd, you know, I'd happily accept that. I don't know why we're just staring at that. Oh my days, why are we just staring at that? Why are we just staring at that? There's two divisions there just sitting. They're still just sitting. Let's just engage them. Why are we... We're staring at this as well. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tag them in. For it. We'll go for the steel plants right now. Um, I don't know if I want to anger. Why would you protect the Dutch East Indies? Well, whatever floats a boat. We've got some encirclements there, so this is good going. Very good going, actually. Oh, there's some gaps we're just staring at. You come here. Oh no, they're bloody. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Just keep them engaged. Keep them engaged until we can cut them off again. So that'd be a nice encirclement to get. They're starting to come down to more our level, in a way. Kind of. Bloody help and circle them. I thought someone was going here. Oh, you are. How many days? Twen 29, di 29 days! The hell? Oh, we got it. We got it. Nice. We've got another division over here. Oh my days, and you've got a division to deal with. Oh my days. Alright, anyways guys, I'm going to leave that episode there, so thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I shall be back next episode to hopefully finish off the US, and yeah, uh, start pumping out the uh, military factories. So, take care. Cheer bye for now.